Hello, space enthusiasts, and welcome back to our YouTube channel. Today, we have an out-of-this-world adventure in store for you as we embark on a journey to explore how the sun looks from each of the planets in our incredible solar system. Buckle up, because it's going to be an illuminating ride. Before we dive into the unique views of our star from each planet, let's briefly remind ourselves of the staggering scale of our solar system. At the heart of it all is the mighty sun, a dazzling ball of hot plasma that provides light and energy to every corner of our cosmic neighborhood. Our first stop on this celestial tour is the closest planet to the sun, Mercury. With its barren, rocky terrain and lack of atmosphere, the sun's harsh glare on Mercury is truly intense. During the day, the sun appears about three times larger and ten times brighter than it does from Earth. Its scorching rays could easily melt lead, making Mercury a true scorched world. Our next destination is Venus, often referred to as Earth's evil twin due to its similar size and composition but hellish conditions. On Venus, thick clouds of sulfuric acid shroud the planet, creating a permanent overcast sky. While you can't see the sun from the surface, if you were floating above the clouds, you'd witness a dim, muted sun struggling to penetrate the thick atmosphere. Here on Earth, we're quite familiar with how the sun looks. It's the source of life, providing warmth and light to our planet. But did you know that the sun's appearance changes depending on your location? Near the equator, it can appear directly overhead, while at higher latitudes, it takes a lower path across the sky. Now, let's hop over to Mars, the red planet. With its thin atmosphere, you'd see a sun that appears only about two-thirds as large as it does from Earth. The Martian sky can sometimes take on a pinkish or butterscotch hue due to the scattering of sunlight by fine dust particles in the atmosphere. An otherworldly sight, to say the least. Our next stop is the gas giant Jupiter. Way out in the outer solar system, Jupiter's enormous size means that it doesn't really have a surface like the inner planets. The Sun, from Jupiter, would appear as just a tiny, brilliant point of light in the distant sky, casting a faint glow on its many moons. Saturn, known for its stunning rings, offers a mesmerizing view of the Sun imagined gazing at the Sun through those magnificent rings. The Sun would appear as a distant, golden speck, casting beautiful ring shadows on Saturn's cloud tops. Uranus, the tilted planet, would offer a peculiar sight. Because of its extreme axial tilt, the sun would roll across the sky, making each day and night last for 17.24 hours. The sun would appear as a pale blue, in Uranus' frigid, sand-colored atmosphere. Our final destination is Neptune, the icy giant. From here, the sun would look like a distant, tiny point of light, even dimmer than it does from Uranus. Neptune's dark blue atmosphere and turbulent weather systems would add to the eerie beauty of this view. And there you have it, fellow space enthusiasts. The Sun, our life-giving star, takes on unique and breathtaking forms when viewed from each of the planets in our magnificent solar system. Remember to like, share, and subscribe for more amazing space content. Until next time, keep looking up at the stars and may your curiosity about the cosmos continue to shine as brightly as the sun itself. Thanks for joining us on this solar tour, and as always, stay curious.